What's up, saints and sinners? How you doing? It's the day after Thanksgiving, and I'm sure you've got a bunch of leftovers, and you're wondering, what do I do with these? Well, let me give you an idea. Today, we're going to do Thanksgiving sliders, courtesy of Chicken Little and our signature seasonings. So, what you're going to do is grab a pack of these King's Hawaiian Rolls. Who doesn't love these King's Hawaiian Rolls, right? Everybody loves them. So, get a pack. Don't pull them apart. Instead, take a nice bread knife and slice right down the middle, and then I'll show you. Just make a top and a bottom. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna make a top and a bottom. Now, through the magic of TV, we have a top and a bottom ready to go for you, and we've got them labeled up, ready to go. I like to use provolone cheese. I think it melts really well. It's a nice kind of mild flavor. You can use Gouda, you can use white cheddar, whatever you wanna do. So we threw down some provolone cheese we're ready to go we've got some turkey leftovers we've chopped them up my assistants have done a great job of chopping them up so we're gonna lay it lay it down right here on the provolone get a nice layer going yes all right now Make sure every bun's gonna have some turkey. Then, let's make it a full Thanksgiving, right? So we're gonna take some leftover stuffing. Does everybody else's houses look like this? Where you got Tupperware, Rubbermaid things going all over the place and you got your leftovers? Well, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take some stuffing and this is super fancy Parker House stove top stuffing. This is how we roll. No, actually, we, we make, uh, some other good stuff in cornbread or sausage and sage. This year we've got just this stove top, so we're gonna throw it on here. I'm gonna top this turkey with some stuffing. You know what, it's just better to use your hands sometimes. So we're gonna do that. Come on up, make sure you got it on all the ro different rolls. Loading this baby up for oh, yeah. Okay. We got stuffing all over. It's falling off. It's a mountain. Thanksgiving mountain right here. That's what we're calling it. Just toss it off. Okay. Then, made some homemade cranberry sauce. Gotta have some sauce. Gotta give it a little bit of extra flavor. Give it a little bit of extra moisture as it gets in here. Of course, the sauce is gonna melt a little bit. That's okay. The cheese is gonna melt too. These are gonna be pulled apart sliders. Mm. So good, so good. Woo. Now our turkey that we did yesterday, of course we seasoned it up with Chicken Little. So we've got some extra Chicken Little on this as well. I'm gonna give it a little dash just for more flavor on top. If you're not familiar with our Chicken Little seasoning, it's a lemon herb kind of seasoning. Very different from a lot of the other chicken seasonings you've got out there, but I guarantee you're gonna love it, especially on turkey. Wonderful that way. We even like it on our salmon and, and uh, shrimp and that kind of. All right, so here we go. We've got everything loaded up. Look how mountainous high it is. We're gonna throw the top on. Oh, baby, this is gonna be good. Then we're gonna give it a little brush with some butter. In the butter, I threw some signature seasoning, which is our salt, pepper, garlic, onion blend. We like a little bit of garlic flavor on top of these rolls. Now, as I'm brushing this on, let me tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna throw this on the Rectech smoker at 350, and it's gonna be good in about 20, 25 minutes. We're gonna watch it just so that it gets carameled up, toasty brown on top and bottom. We don't want it to get burnt or anything like that. So we got that all labeled up, ready to go. We're gonna do this with the second batch. We're gonna take it out to the smoker. We're gonna put it on the smoker for 350 for 20 minutes. And then we're gonna bring it right back in here and we'll check it later with some finished product. Well, welcome back, guys. All right, so I said 20, 25 minutes on the smoker at 350. Try 15, because these are these are done. They're ready to roll. 
We've got a nice crispy top on them, crispy bottom. I already gave it a little slice with my awesome Spaceman knife. Look at this pull apart though. Oh yeah. You got the melted cheese, you got the stuffing, you got the turkey, you got the cranberry sauce, and you got the roll. All in one, nice little slider, nice little evening meal. You really don't need anything else. Maybe a beer. Thanksgiving, right there, on a roll, ready to roll. Super easy, try it out this time, try it out tomorrow, Sunday, whenever. Maybe you just gotta go, oh my gosh, we don't have any more leftovers. You gotta make a whole nother Thanksgiving meal and just do this. Or if you do the same thing for Christmas, plan that. Guys, go out there, have fun, be creative, use our products, don't use our products, use our products, we love y'all. Have, have a good time. We'll see you.